back up to about 75 for a high on Monday with a few more clouds in the area here. Greg and Rosanna. All right, what do you think about a video that's been viewed more than 180 million times on YouTube? One of the hottest videos, quite frankly, since they started doing videos. <laughs> Robin Thicke's Blurred Lines. Look at her, that's Emily Radikowski. And she is extraordinary. Uh, quite frankly, once again, people started to ignore Robin Thicke, just like <laughs> at the VMAs, and focus on Emily. And there's so much buzz about this that, hey, she's got a new movie role. She's going to be starring in Gone Girl. They already started filming. Emily Ratajkowski, welcome to Good Day New York. Hi, thanks for having nice me. Nice to morning. see you. So, uh, did you do anything before this video? G get us up to date on like what's going on with your life. Um, okay, so I went to UCLA for a year, which not a lot of people know. That's a competitive school, particularly if you're from California, and I believe you yes, grew up in California. Yeah, I, w I grew up in San Diego. Um, so I got in, and I was like, oh my god, I got into college. So <laughs> um, I pursued that for a little bit, and then decided to become a model. What was your major? when you were uh, at UCLA. I was an art major. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But Mima, like, you come from, like, a brilliant family. Your oh, mother... thank you. Your mother... Yeah, she's an English professor, and my dad is a painter, so I think maybe that rubbed off on me a little bit, and that's why I ended up majoring in art. Good stuff, Emily, but I'm looking at, I think, the PG-13 version of this video. <laughs> I and would say that is PG-13. We are on television. Yeah, you, on, you undress. Yes, I, I, yeah, is that right? Was that? <laughs> not wrong, it's not wrong. <laughs> was that weird for you? Um, no, you know, I think it was such a comfortable environment on set. Uh, the director, Diane Martel, made everyone feel really comfortable, and we just had fun, which I think comes across in the video. What's Robin Thicke like? Super nice guy. He's really, so really cute, nice. is he cute? Yeah, and his son is adorable, who came to set later. The son, with, yeah. what, with, with clothes He's on so, or with clothes off? He was, he was clothed, and we, this was like the lunch break, but beautiful little boy. Good yeah. stuff. Yeah. So now from this video, are you getting other opportunities? Yeah, definitely. Um, I was just on the cover of CR Fashion Book, uh, shot by Bruce Weber. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, that just came out this month. And then I just booked Gone Girl. So with David Fincher directing. That's and, a big time movie. And Ben Affleck. And Ben Affleck. What's has, it about? Um, so it's about a woman who goes missing and her husband's reaction and a little bit of a mystery. I mean, I think a lot of people have read the book, but I'll let them see the movie. What role do you play? Do I play like... Andy, so I am Ben Affleck's mistress. Oh! Yeah. Good stuff. Wow. Do you think Jennifer Garner is going to be on the set when you're there? I don't know. I hope so. I haven't met her, so maybe. And besides the movie, any other projects in the works? Uh, lots of things that I can't talk about. We understand. Um, especially fashion. People like to keep things secret. Yeah. So, so what's your normal routine like? I mean, you get up, do you work out? Well, because yeah. you have a pretty amazing body. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, I just try to be as healthy as possible. I eat healthy. I love walking the city. Um, I jog. I do yoga. You live in New York? Yes. I'm actually oh. bi-coastal, but I do have an apartment here, so. Good stuff. Yeah, um, you kind of have to be when you're doing both things, yeah. so. Is Are, there a downside to any of this? I mean, it's hard, it's, it, it looks glamorous, and a lot of it is, but I know that there's kind of, there's some things that some people don't know about. Yeah, I think, um, you know, flying is one of those things. You get to travel everywhere, but when you spend a lot of time on planes, you get a little, like, crazy and you get ogled a lot let's face it you oh. walk around right i mean is that is that ever a burden um you know i think i'm still getting used to people recognizing me on the street um i'm always like oh they must know me <laughs> hi emily hi oh how do i know you yeah um so now i'm starting to get better at being like oh you want a picture okay hi you know <laughs> but before it was always like oh did we go to high school together or you know yeah, how do i know you, you i'm not very good teacher. with faces either so. um are you dating anybody what's the story uh, i like to keep my personal life to myself. Okay. Oh, that's great, but I'm come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because there's two single people sitting on no, this no, couch. No, no, that would not, that she's not getting at that, but yeah, tell us I something like that's to. not, you know, come on, you got it, you're seeing somebody, right? I don't know, I can't tell Maybe you yes anything. Maybe yes or no, by yeah. coastal. Yeah, I just like, you know, I can say that I'm a very busy person, so whoever I'm seeing, if I am seeing anybody, has to be ready for that. They got a role in the big leagues. Yeah, I don't know big leagues, but certainly a busy life. So the acting thing, I mean, this um, is new for you, right? Well, I did do iCarly when I was 17. I was on two episodes of oh, that. Oh, okay. um, And I actually started modeling through acting. I loved theater when I was a little kid. Um, I was kind of a theater geek, and I sort of stopped doing it. I was pursuing art, and now I've come full circle. So, any consideration to going back to school? And again, getting into UCLA when you're a, when you are a California resident, it's like ultra competitive. That's yeah. a real.
accomplishment. Oh, thank Would you. Would uh, you go back someday, you think? Maybe someday, yeah. I think right now life is pretty busy and yeah. I'm pretty happy with the way things are going, but definitely, you know, something to consider. By the way, we're looking at you and I, Carly. Oh, there I am. How long ago was that? Um, God, so I was 17. How great is her Yeah, I think I just turned 17. And how old are you now, Emily? I'm 22. I just turned 22. So, Fantastic. Yeah, it's fun to see. I haven't actually watched the episode in a long time. But, um, yeah, it's funny to come from that and now, you know, go into an audition room with David Fincher and Ben Affleck and have to perform and, you know, get the part, which just is so exciting. Well, congratulations. Thank when does you. that movie come out again? Do you know? Uh, 2015, so you have a little bit wow. to wait. Yeah. Getting back to the blurred lines thing, did you know that you had to take off your clothes when you Of when you course. Started? You did? Yeah. Okay. I actually initially turned the video down, which I don't think a lot of people know. Um, on paper, it sounded really crazy. I wasn't convinced of it. Um, and then I met but the director, Diane Martel, and we sort of talked about what she wanted to portray and the attitude, and um, she sold me on it. So, do you did you have choreography or did you kind of make up the dance steps? It was as sort you of going? both. Like she would say, "Okay, I want you to just go out there and have." We definitely had the stomping down that like little walk. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but you know, the scene with the car going down the back—that was kind of a collaborative thing. Gotcha. Did it make it easier to do because Diane Martel? I assume that's a woman. Yeah. You know, a female director, kind of running the show. Definitely, and there was a female DP, yeah. and um, I think she was just really respectful, and we are friends, so there was moments where I could like go to her and say, yeah, I want to do this, and well, let's try this, and she's a playful person, obviously. I have a better feeling about it, really. I did not see the, uh, the more advanced version. Oh, now that wow. I've heard this and how comfortable you are yeah. when we're with the uh, decision, I'll check it out. Yeah, please do. All right. Well, it's so nice to meet so you in nice person. So nice to meet you. Congratulations Thank you so much. on all your projects. Yeah, wonderful to be here. Say this hello morning. to Robin Thicke for us. We I like will. it. What do you think of the fall duds? I totally love it. I was watching it from back there, and I was like, they look great. You, yeah. you, you don't think it's too much? We look like fashion victims. No, instead of, <laughs> I don't think so. You know, like when you try too hard. No, yeah. I think he made a really good point. Separate, you know, maybe better. Maybe like, Emily needs to be in the middle of us. Oh, uh, I don't know. Maybe. Like a, a big white sure. blob? Sure. Sure. I don't know. Have a seat. Oh, gosh. Okay. <laughs> is it breaking it up? We yeah, have to I, see the I, tweets. I, I, Look, you watch, 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 watch now. He just can't I, talk. I, no, shut up. <laughs> I, I, all right. What, what happens in the show now? <laughs> all right. Well, all right. you want to talk about what's coming up? Um, yeah, Emily, you want to read the prompter for us? We got a sumo oh, wrestler wow. coming up. Okay, three time world sumo wrestling champion. Bayamba. Bayamba. Okay. We'll so here. you're going to have to translate yeah. the rest of that. All right. Thanks so much, <laughs> Thank Emily. Thank you so much. All right. Good day's coming right Thanks back. Thanks so much. So nice Let's to get you. A There's so many things that 